guys, it's Kim here. Welcome back to my vlog channel and today is Vlogmas day number 14. So we are checking out of this hotel today. We are going to go down to breakfast. It is 10 past 9 so we have 20 minutes before breakfast closes. Then I have to come back to the room, do my makeup, get ready to go out, then finish packing my bags. Our next hotel is like, well, by train it's like 7 minutes away so it's very close. Or walking would take... 17 minutes, but I think we're going to take the train because we do have heavy luggage and just in case we have to carry our luggage upstairs I'm not really up for that because I think my bag is kind of heavy. So yeah, I'm gonna go down to breakfast now and start the day So I just finished my makeup and hair and we are ready to change hotels now. So we just packed up our luggage. This is mine, but I'm actually thinking about shipping some stuff back because I put on this massive dress yesterday, put it back in my suitcase and like I realize it's just taking up a lot of space. So I might ship some stuff back in a few days time and if I do, I'll film it for you guys because you guys always ask me questions on how to ship stuff back. So yeah, might film like I guess a tutorial on how to ship stuff back to your home country from Japan. For now, we're just going to say goodbye to this beautiful room. Our next hotel, Hotel Villa Fontaine. I stayed here before last year when I was here on a work trip for Akita. Now, okay, when I was booking hotels, this was like one of the only hotels that had twin rooms left because I booked really last minute. But because I've stayed in this hotel before, I know that it's pretty good and it's very convenient. And it was only like 10 minutes away from our previous hotel. It took us a bit longer to get here just because the train was super full and we were just doing some filming around the train station. but. We made it in the end, we're just going to drop off our luggage and then we're going to head off to Akihabara! To change of plans, the original plan was to go to Akihabara and meet up with Adam but we have to go to Tokyo Station first because he is leaving to go to Osaka tonight and he needs a place to leave his luggage so I was like, oh, I'll meet you at Tokyo Station first Put your stuff in a locker and then we can head off to Akihabara then. Now I'm lost. Let's look at the map. It's lunchtime right now, so I really want Taco Bell. It's really close to our hotel. So I'm gonna get um, lunch first with Mel and then we're gonna meet Adam at Tokyo Station after. I mean, because there's not too much we want to do in Akihabara anyway today, I think we are just going to chill around Tokyo Station first so we can go to the Pokemon centers and then from there we'll go to Akihabara. So we have to go that way? Let's go, let's go that way, yeah. I always get confused with all these underground passages. Uh, let's go up this way. Yesterday we did a lot of walking so I don't want to go up any more stairs. I'm so hungry, I'm so keen for Taco Bell. It's such beautiful weather today, like the first day was really cold and it just got warmer and warmer. It's good because I don't even have to wear heat packs. The big clock just then is the Studio Ghibli clock and it's in Shiodome station and every hour they have like a little mini show. So we're gonna go get Taco Bell and I'm so excited. There's an Okonomiyaki Fiesta, Japan Limited only, Okonomiyaki Taco, Okonomiyaki Burrito and Crunchwrap. I don't know how I feel about that. I got the Cheesy Core Burrito, Nachos, and I also got a taco. 
So we have made it to Tokyo Station and we're just going to walk around Character Street first whilst we wait for Adam to come. He's currently on the train coming to Tokyo. So I told him when you arrive, stay on the platform, don't move, tell me which platform you're on and I'm going to go meet you so we can find a locker for your back. And they have a bunch of new ones. Look at this. This is party ice cream flavor. And they have the Tokyo banana one now. This one's been around for a while, Kit Kat. Oh, suck. They got Umeshu. Wow. I want to get this after. So we're going to head to Character Street now and we're just going to check out the Pokemon store. See if there's any new merch that I would like to buy. Well, usually in the Pokemon store, I buy the clothes because I think it's so adorable. And at least it's something I can use. Sometimes plushes as well. Guys, oh my god, we just walked past a Harry Potter store. This was never here before. There's just way too many people there, so we thought let's just um, come back another time, not on a Sunday. So we're just gonna go back into JR to meet my friend and then find our locker. So here are the lockers that we can use to store our luggage in. Low jokes. We went to the locker storage area. It's all full. So now we have to take the luggage with us to Akihabara and hopefully we can find a luggage service there. We finally found a locker. Oh my god. Oh. So you put in your coins. Oh, it's 500. It needs to be, it needs to be lots 100. of hundreds. Yes. Take a picture of this one in case you forget where it is. Okay. So this all take a photo of all Everyone, please take a picture. Remember. <laughs> Alright, so we're here earlier. All of the lockers are gone. Like, it's so damn hard to get a locker today. Seriously. So now that the luggage saga is finished, we are outside in Akihabara and they close the streets on Sunday in the afternoon. So you can just walk around on the streets with no cars, you can take photos on here. Adam's got some interesting gear. It's gonna show us how it works. This is so cool though, like the streets are all closed, so we'll close the cars and just everyone's around taking photos. So we are in front of Super Potato, we're going to go in. It's like a retro game arcade slash door. There's lots of vintage games, so let's go in. One of my favorite places. Oh, here you come in. So you keep saying what what is my good Yeah. Uh, I guess not. This one was one of the best games, Super Mario World and Super Mario RPG. I love that one. Wow oh, man, they're pricey. Oh, they are. Oh my gosh, they're like $250 each. This one's $200. Oh, 
I mean, I guess they're really rare now. It's like impossible to get anywhere else. Games like this yes, damn. I used to have this one, that controller. Mm. And I had this see-through purple one. Oh, those are new. Oh yes. Oh, this was my first Game Boy. They turn on your Um, it should work. Put batteries in it though. I remember um, my first Game Boy was when I was 10 years old and I had this exact one and then my first game was Pokemon Silver before that I just played on my computer on an emulator Did you ever, did you ever use this? No I never had that one, I always had this, I had this one then, I had, then after that I sold this I got a Game Boy Advance which they don't have here The original Pokemon Green Red Yellow Gold Oh Crystal, I love that one. Oh, the Pokemon card game. This game is 55 yen, that's like 50 cents. This game is $3. That's so cool. They got new Gachapons. This one's so cool. Oh my gosh, I wish this was here when I was in Japan last time when I made that video. That's so cool, I want that. Dude, oh my gosh, is this a vending machine? Bro, that is cool. It's a vending machine. Have you seen this? Oh yeah, I've seen this. Oh, actually, what? I actually like this one as well. You have one. I have this one. Yeah, yeah I put my cables in there. <laughs> it's really cool. Dude, there's like miniature collections. I wish this was here last time. But I would have so bought these. So tempted to play more gacha phone, but must not. <laughs> Try and stop myself. I love the shiver one. <laughs> Pulling on the leash. collaboration it looks so cute yeah So we just left the main Shinjuku area and now we are at the Park Hyatt Hotel. So we just really want to check out the New York bar. I've been there a few times before, it's beautiful. It's where Lost in Translation was filmed. So if you're looking for a fancy night out in Tokyo, then this is the place to be. Now, okay, we are here pretty early. It's 5.30 p.m. It's really dark for 5.30, but it's winter. If you go in after 7 p.m., there is a cover charge and it's 2,500 yen, which is about $25 just to enter but if you go before that there's no cover charge so that's why we're going in at 5 30 and also Adam has to take his bullet train to Osaka tonight so it's best to go early anyways Bar just having a drink. I got the this is 
the Kanaji Hall. So it has grey goose coffee infused white chocolate and beetroot. So I had this last time as well. Because of the beetroot, it looks pink. station to pick up the luggage we left behind. Adam's going to go to Osaka after this. I know it was this one, this one, this one, this one. This yeah. Moment of truth. <laughs> you open up it's empty? No. no! Yes! Okay. We just dropped off Adam and now we are going to head to the Pokemon Center DX because we didn't have time earlier on in the day. They just gave us a free Pokemon card when we walked into the Pokemon Center. How cute is that? This bag is adorable. I kind of want it, but I don't know what I'd use it for. Like, would you hang them? Because I probably wouldn't hang them. I like these ones. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So freaking cute. Executor Ditto. Wobbuffet Ditto. She's already like, you know majestic and she's even more majestic I love that so extra this is my favorite collection the fluffies I have um, I have the Pikachu the Bulbous oh, I have Pikachu and all the starters and I got the Eevee as well I had the Mimikyu I was gonna get the magic card but nah that this Snorlax though so look at that look oh at I want this look at these cases so pretty yeah this is my favorite collection. It's so pretty and pastel. This bag, gorgeous. Fluffy socks. I love these headbands. I keep buying so many of them, but like I don't need more. <laughs> I really want to buy this rubber luggage tag because I think it's hilarious. It's just a magic cup, it's so cool. Nice. Noah's buying a lot. <laughs> But to be fair, it's the first time in the Pokemon Center. For me, I don't think I'm going to get anything today. There's a few things I want, but I might just wait it out and see if I really want it or not. Usually for me, if I shop, if I am not sure if I want it or not, then I will wait for a few days. And if I keep thinking about it, then I'll go back and get it. Yay. But no, it's Harry Potter theme. It just I makes no it's sense. Harry Potter theme, but it doesn't make sense. Yeah. Oh, no, it doesn't make sense. I won't. They have new earrings. Look, this is adorable. Dude, I think I'm going to get these ones. This is so cool. This one doesn't look like Pikachu, doesn't it? No, not those ones. I'm not a fan. Mm. Nah, not those. I don't. I don't like the ones that's just one dangling. Yeah, I think because they're part of the illusions. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that one. Mm, yeah, I don't like. I like this. If it if it was two of these ones, mm. I would buy it. But I don't like this one dangling one. Mm, okay, I got these ones. I really like them. Yeah, I like these ones. I'm, I'm paranoid of wearing hoop earrings. I'm scared someone's gonna come by and just like go and rip my ear out. Probably me. <laughs> I mean, I'll probably, not be probably um, I mean, I don't think that would happen, but you know, I'm just, I'm just like paranoid. The Steelix looks so derpy. <laughs> made it back to our building. Well, it only took five minutes by taxi, so that was really good. Um, now we're looking for a convenience store and I swore there was one around here. I just don't remember where it is. We found the family mart. It's like a very fancy version. <laughs> so, I 
few days, maybe. Grab six for now. Cool. Um, should get some dinner as well. Shin ramyeon mini. Heck yes. There we go. And if I'm eating shin ramyeon, you need the salted boiled egg too. They were setting up the Christmas tree earlier today. Now it's finished. We are at our room. Let's see what it's like. Let me just put this. Oh, nice. A room, not as spacious as the other one, but I mean, that's to be expected anyway, because this one was um, a bit cheaper. Anyway, so this is our room. Um, we got the superior twin room. I really want to see if there's a view. Not much of a view, but that's okay. There's a nice tower in front of us. Um, you can see a train down there, but yeah, okay, maybe take some of We have a humidifier here. We have a big TV. We also have a small coffee table, I guess, and then some chairs. Then let's go to the bathroom and have a look. The bathroom, so it's just a typical Japanese business hotel bathroom. Um, and then the amenities are pretty standard. You've got toothbrush, razors, hairbrush, cotton sets, and uh, wash towels. And oh, we get free water. So every day we get a free bottle of water, which is cool. Got some cups, coffee, and a safe, a fridge where I need to put my coffees. Yeah. Oh, we also have a kettle so I can make my instant noodles and a hair dryer. Just going to put my coffees inside. Now that I'm back in my hotel, I'm going to show you guys what I bought today. I only bought one thing at the Pokemon Center. So, oh, I destroyed it. Okay. Whoop. I just got a pair of Eevee earrings like they were so cute I could not turn them down oh that's pretty hey guys I think I'm just gonna end this video here um, I mean it's still pretty early it's like 9 o'clock but I am just exhausted the past few days have been full on we've been shooting so many photos and videos so yeah I'm gonna try and have an early night tomorrow we are going to go and have or you can eat KFC. So I'm super excited. It just opened up in Yokohama, I think, a couple of months ago. So it's pretty new. Um, Stella is going to come to our hotel to meet us and then we're going to go together. Then after KFC, we're going to come back to our hotel and I think we are going to be filming a video for Stella's channel. It's going to be exciting because I haven't seen Stella in a while so it will be good to catch up with her again. Thank you so much guys for watching. Uh, I love you all and I'll see you guys in the next Vlogmas video. Bye guys!